Hello everyone, welcome back to another Disney Do Adventure. We're back at Disneyland for the opening weekend of the Disney 100 celebration in the parks. We're so excited for all the new food offerings we're going to try for you guys, of course. Yeah. Check out all the decorations and there's so much to see, entertainment included. Dapper Dan's, the cavalcade, there's a lot to do, a lot to see. Yes, can't wait for it all. So we better get to it. <laughs> right off the bat, noticing that the the Esplanade loop, the Esplanade music is different. Yeah, we've already heard uh, Great Big, Big Beautiful, Beautiful Tomorrow. Tomorrow with the words. Too. And then, what else did we hear? I, okay, I heard, didn't hear it myself, but heard it online. Spaceship Earth is in it. Too. Yes. I know we heard the Main Street Electrical Parade, but that's, oh, something, yeah. that's nothing to brag about. We've <laughs> heard, heard that a million times. There's one other one. Oh, Magic Happens. Thank you, Magic Happens. That was on happens. the tram. That yes. was exciting. We're that waiting for that to, to come hear. back. It, like, brought up so much excitement and feelings mm -hmm. in me. I'm like, oh, this is good to hear it again. So. Soon, next month. Soon, very soon. Yeah. Heading inside the park and spotted is a new poster for Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway. So yeah, I love it. I love the color. Mm -hmm. wow. Look at Donald looking all sassy. <laughs> Classic. We don't often get a new addition to the tunnel, so. Yeah. And it features all the little, like, a lot of scenes from the rides, too. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Yeah. So we are, it's about three minutes away until the Dapper Dan step off, so we are going to Try to catch them. They're gonna be uh, playing maybe Town Square, Main Street. Stay tuned. So we saw a crowd hanging around the train station. So we just figured, hey, that's probably where the Dapper Dans are gonna meet up. I just heard the marching bands coming down from the castle right now. Oh, there you so go. So we're gonna get to see a little show. <laughs> <laughs> also, did want to mention that the official hundredth doesn't start till October sixteenth. That is the official anniversary, but it looks like they wanted to start nine months early. Classic Disney. Uh, you just taught me something right yeah. now. I didn't even know that. That's pretty cool. <laughs> yeah. And then they could also kind of spot the Mickey statue. Uh, we were here. We were here on Monday, so let's talk about that. We were here on Monday, so yes. six days ago, today's Sunday. For the first day of cast previews for mm -hmm. Mickey Minnie's Runaway Railway. Yeah, and there was no filming yeah, allowed you whatsoever. Yeah, your phone like in a wrapped bag, so you, no filming, nothing, no recording. Even Apple watches could not wear them. Yeah. Um, but the ride was fantastic. I wanted to show you guys, but mm -hmm. we couldn't. Um, so we're hoping to go on it today again. And yeah. Yeah, and then on Wednesday they all are also doing cast previews. Um, that was the first day that the first day that you could film. So, how do we have known? We probably would have chose that day, but that's but okay. It's all, right. it all worked out. All's well ends well. Yeah, and then at Christmas Tree Point, it's funny when we were in the park that day. There was just like a bunch of wood chips. Um, obviously now they put like a Mickey statue, so we'll get a closer look at that in just a moment here. But um, it's always really jarring when you just see like an empty plot of land Nothing right there. there Nothing yeah. there. Yeah. Like a Christmas tree, the pumpkin, or some <laughs> nice flowers. It's got to be something. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Courtney reminds me of someone. I'm not sure if y'all feel the same exact way as I do. Maybe I am imagining we'll things. We'll say the but... show first. Huh? Say the yeah, show first. something from How I Met Your Mother. How does she do it? Like a little. Yeah. <laughs> Robin Sparkle in the flesh. That's all I can think of now. I look in the mirror. Let's go to the mall, mall. <laughs> today. All right, here they come. And down Main Street, and then they're gonna stop and do a little number in front of the train station. I actually just talked to my friend D uh, Dapper, one of the Dapper Dans, Dapper Steve, there in the blue. Uh, he gave me a little bit of helpful information. Um, but yes, so they will be stopping at the train station. I'm gonna follow him up. There he is. <laughs> Genie Plus today we have free photo pass photos so we are trying to take advantage we're gonna yeah. take a photo uh, in front of this 
new Mickey Mouse statue that we pointed out earlier. Uh, there was some controversy earlier. They said it all started with the mouse, and it's people were saying it's of a the paraphrase. original quote. Exactly. But it's super cute, so I can't mm -hmm. be mad at it. <laughs> but yeah, I love the the purple flowers. Definitely beats looking at wood chips. <laughs> Even like all of the banners are gorgeous. Too. Yeah. It's just a nice, like, elegant touch, I would say. Definitely. I like the uh, iridescent look to it as well. Yeah, it's very nice. Here is a closer look. Okay, 1223. Shortly after the, the band plays, the Dapper Dance play, and the, characters. and the characters leave, they come back shortly after, so yeah. don't go too far away from, from don't Town go too Square. Far. Yeah. They come out, it's called, we call it Egg House Gate. It's yeah. They come out that gate right there. So mm -hmm. I don't know. It's supposed to be on the app either. Yeah. So they come out a bit earlier than the app is at time. Yeah, so there's Mickey over there. Goofy meets kind of by the train station. And then I believe we just saw Pluto come out. I'm not sure if he's in position yet. Um, but we are in line for Minnie Mouse. Yay! We had to see Minnie. We had to see our <laughs> <Queen>. Minnie. <laughs> All right, we're next in line to meet Minnie. Ah! You want to go for it? Go yeah. ahead. Go ahead. Hi. Hi. Oh, look gorgeous. Oh, photo pass, please. Yeah, thank you. I got you everywhere. You can kill my jacket, too. Hi, Jim. Hi, Jim. All right, friends. One, two, and three. One, two, and three. One, two. Oh, I love that. There we go. One, two, and three. Just met Minnie. We're on a, a good high right now. Oh, yeah. She was 10 out of 10. She was awesome. I love Minnie. She's fully one of my favorite Disney characters of all time. Great captain. Great captain. Great captain. Disney, Disney Cruise Wish. Line. Yep. It was smooth sailing mm -hmm. with Minnie. Captain Minnie. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so now we are going to go ahead into great moments with Mr. Lincoln because we hear there's some special things inside. Different things, they yeah. They totally change the inside mm -hmm. with some cool Disney 100 artifacts. So, so let's, let's go, go see. Let's go do that. Yeah, so it looks like Mickey's meeting here to the right. Pluto just here to the left. Chippendale over there by those big double doors. And we are headed into great moments with Mr. Lincoln. Presenting. Presenting. Disney 100, Years of Wonder, so let's head inside. <laughs> they even have purple flowers out here. Purple flowers out here. Um, so let's head inside. We are inside now, and here, there used to be like this massive park map of the early days of Disneyland, and it's completely gone now, which is kind of crazy, because it's very iconic. Um, but they have like this cool multi, a little model of the multi-plane camera that they use, kind of showing how still pretty big. in action. <laughs> yeah, still pretty big. Uh, but they use this back in the oh, yeah. day. There's different layers to it, and they can kind of they put different art on different layers, and then it kind of looks like you're inside of a film, like you're moving in. Like here, and they're playing the special. Why explain it. it when I can just show <laughs> sure. you? So yeah, the house in the field would be on like one level, the hills in the background on another, and then the moon on the last one. And here is a animator's desk. Classic. Very classic. My favorite character is Minnie Mouse, but did you guys know that Donnie's favorite character is the old hag? This is not true at all. <laughs> <laughs> so she actually was um, a fixture in the Main Street Jewelry Shop, and she would talk to her audience, and her eyes would glow yellow. Oh wow. So that sounds terrifying yeah. for children and adults. Um, As most like early attractions were, they just like freaked out little kids. Yeah, things yeah. were on the scarier side, that's for sure. Like yeah, Snow White exactly. Scary Adventures. H hence the rename, yeah. The rename. Just some concept art for Mr. Toad's Wild Ride. Yeah, just different attractions. Here's Peter, Peter Pan's Pan. Flight, Dumbo, Casey Jr. Oh, wow. This looks like the, um, the live action. This is based off of live action. He's quite tall. He looks real. <laughs> some more attraction art featuring Mary Blair, one of our favorites. So Alice, oh, this is so whimsical looking. I love it. This is funny. This is like would never fly into it. this the caterpillar smoking hookah while like people were riding the rides. It's hilarious. That's a hazard. <laughs> <laughs> I noticed they did refresh the yesterday, today, and tomorrow. It's been kind of stagnant for a while. So these always stay here. These are the yesterday photos of just classic attractions, park, rocket rods too. Give it some love. Today, featuring a lot of like, you know, Star Wars Galaxy's Edge. And tomorrow, but t t tomorrow is today. Tomorrow, tomorrow. <laughs> we have Mickey's Toontown. Well, that's coming soon, but Renault Railway is out and then coming soon. Tiana's Bayou Adventure. Adventure. 
TBD. Already closing Disney World. We're excited. <laughs> There's and, rumors and for that May is May, going to be closing here. And then Tiana's Palace Restaurant. We're so excited yeah. for that to yeah. come soon to the French Market. Mm -hmm. Woo! Okay, I found the Indiana Jones Adventure board. You already know I've got to represent. Your boy. Um, so it is closed for about two months for refurbishment. So they are fixing some of the things that need a lot of fixing. Um, the rolling bowl scene, the walls haven't been moving for a long time, so they're going to be try fixing those. Um, just audio. There's one other thing that I'm missing too. Animatronics? Maybe Animatronics. Yeah, probably just clean a them tune up, up a little a bit. Tune up. Um, I know some of the mouth like talking has been a little bit off. Yeah. Well, you know what I'd love to see though, Indiana Jones, is something that they haven't had since it opened. You're, you're going to say the ice. The yep, the, it looks like falling, falling rocks. Yeah. It's ice effect, mm -hmm. and I would love to see that brought back. I think we could do it. We could do it nowadays. 2023. I think so too. Yeah. Um, I think stuff in the queue as well is what they were going to fix oh, too. Yes. The the pull. I know that's always like in and out. The one that you pull on it mm -hmm. has the kind of the rumbling and all that. Yeah. This this ride, and then they're also going to fix like boring computer stuff. The attraction was built in 1995, not 55, 1995, <laughs> so it's built on computers and as you know computers have a tendency to crash and it's, imagine if one crashes, like one of the vehicles, then the whole ride goes down. So then the ride breaks down a lot. It's literally like the number one ride that breaks down. It's notorious for it. So it's running um, on Windows 95, which we're running on Exactly. Apple. So they're going to fix that and hopefully it fixes much needed problems. It's a great ride. Chris. We do really, really love it. Yeah. It's a fantastic ride. I think it's, <laughs> it's my favorite themed ride. It's like you're in a movie. From the it's... moment you get into the queue all the way through the attraction itself, it's my favorite themed ride of all time at Disney's end. Here's some like 3D models. Indiana Jones looks like he's holding up the doors. Yeah, just yeah. imagine the doors back the, there. The Tunnel of Torment, <laughs> as they call it. Inside Mad Hatter, they have the Jungle Cruise ears from Disney World's 50th anniversary, and then they also have some new ears for the 100th anniversary. It's really fun. They have a lot of like Disney Studio nods. Yeah. Some little kind of confetti here. Mm hmm. Moves around, some sketches. This is called like... a clapper, right? Is that what it's called? I, it's I called think clapper. so. Yeah. yeah, the clapper. <laughs> and these are $35. 35 nice. Yeah, those look really cool. This is kind of fun too. These are, These are very beady. Yeah, reminds me of my crafting days. I'm still crafting. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of like when you do the iron on beads. Yeah, you know? exactly. Some little hidden Mickeys in there as well. And a Valentine's. I think everyone did that. Even I did that at one point, yeah, yeah. making little bracelets. <laughs> it's 12:58. We're gonna try to get the no. one o'clock boarding group for the Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway. My heart is racing. So this is the home page. Come down. You're gonna want to go to join virtual queue. You're gonna want to confirm your party. Yes. And then we are seconds away here. You're gonna hit this refresh button at Woo. one o'clock. So it's fingers like, crossed. Just got both of our phones open. Yeah. I don't My think it's gonna work for both of us, but. Hey. Let's see. We go to the clock. We're 30 yeah, seconds away. There's a lot of people who are just standing. But on I'm wondering people maybe forgot busy and forgot that it's one o'clock. Lots to hope. Ten seconds away. Okay, oh, come gosh. back here. Right. Maybe odds over in our favor. I know. Are you shaking? No, I'm not shaking. <laughs> no. Join virtual queue. Something went no. wrong. Oh no. What happened? I didn't Did get you it. get it? No. Excuse? <laughs> Join virtual queue? I think everyone's trying to get it. Okay, so quick little update. It's 101. As soon as one o'clock hit, it said join virtual queue and it said there was an error. Mine said, I clicked it and it said it's gone. They're already gone. So, so I don't know how this works exactly. It was just that quick. Yeah, apparently so, which is crazy. So if you are one of the lucky ones to get a boarding group, then more power to you. This is pretty crazy. I feel like they kind of force you to, because you can buy a la carte. And I feel like, and it's $20 person. So that's one way to get in if you're okay doing that, but. Crazy, like one. They may have one... not released many wait times at afternoon because yeah. if they hadn't got through many in the morning. Exactly. I know that's how we, eyes we, we did check the earlier, and it did say that it was closed. So yeah. maybe they. They're trying to catch up and didn't release too many exactly. right now. Exactly. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. That's okay. We'll be back. <laughs>
Okay, just finished the cavalcade, and right where we were standing, just behind us, are three windows, which is really convenient because we wanted to show them off. Our good friend uh, Hayden Evans, who is now works at Disneyland in the parks after hours, um, he comes in here and like does design work, and so he designed these three, three windows. windows. Yeah. So let me well, go ahead and show off. Part. Here it is, Disney 100. Have the ears that we just showed off at the Mad Hatter, and then uh, I did want to point out. Oh yeah, here's Pocahontas. We have the other um, story stock below. Yeah. Utopia, Frozen mm -hmm. over here. Ricky Ralph. Did a really good job. Good job, Hayden. And then uh, his favorite character is Captain Hook. <laughs> so he plays a big part. So here he is, right here. It looks so, awesome. Love that. Did a really good job. Super fun. I love this shirt. This shirt's really cool. It looks like it looks like the uh, like the e-ticket. Yeah, here it is. I the feel like e the windows really exemplify like the Disney story. And like for 100 years, it's perfect. Yeah. It's got the films, the stories, the mm -hmm. characters. It starts with Snow White, the first princess, and perfect. it goes through the years, Cinderella. Even and Fantasia, Mickey. Yeah. It's awesome. And the the stars light up in the background too. Second star to the right. Straight on to morning. Great job, Hayden. Yeah, good job. Love it. And this Mickey's actually really funny. His like ears are slicked back. It kind of looks like there's like gel in his hair. But it's called a mouseker. It was the award given internally in the Walt Disney Company before they had the the um, the big award we would give at D23. The the legacy. legacy. The, yeah. The, yes. And then this is pretty funny. You spotted this earlier, but this is a like a little typewriter, and it has notepads. To carry your notepads. Oh, sorry, the Disney legend. The Disney legend. Disney legend. Legacy legends. is in the park. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Wanted to show off this other mini statue. A dream is a wish your heart makes. Right to the left of the Tomorrowland entrance. Very cute. I love the park. Yeah. It's very quiet over here too. <laughs> no one's like taking pictures or. Because you can't really stand next to her. Yeah, exactly. She oh, she is in a heart. Yeah. Oh, I just noticed cute. that. Very cute. Perfect. Love you, Minnie. Okay, we made our way to the castle. Yeah. I feel like it took us a long yeah, time did. to get past we Main spent Street. We a lot of time Main Street. That's yeah. okay. I love Main Street. Yeah. Made to the castle. She looks beautiful. Mm -hmm. Iridescent, sparkling. Are the fountains very nice? They, they have, have the hundreds. Some fountains. There so. are, yeah. I'm not sure if they're on a timer or not, but you are right. I forgot There's about that, right that one little bit. They did add the fountains. You're, oh, there it says, ask and you shall receive. Wow. Is that, wow. Is that a wish? Granted? That? <laughs> <laughs> Well, there is a flora, fauna, and merryweather. Yeah. Right and then, if you can see on the very, kind of almost like a cup, you have the wishing star. Yeah. Which kind of reminds me of Disney Wish. You know what? I see it. You know what I mean? I think you're just daydreaming of the, the wish <laughs> at all times. This is the wishing star that you know. No, I that. get it though. Yeah, no, absolutely, 100%. Yeah, that fountain is really kind of goes up high. Yeah, and there's one on the other side, of course. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, I love it. I love the, That's I love great. the banners. Also, you got very elegant. Very elegant, yes. Very classy. Yeah, so now we're going to check out the wishing wheel. It's already spruced up for Valentine's Day. You are correct. There are flowers. I love how, like, not crowded it is over here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And there's the Urbibon tree right there. Oh, yeah. Check that out. This is a story that I can tell in Holy Time at Disneyland Resort Tour, if you've taken it before. Mm. It's the Urbibon tree. <laughs> so, it's a great story. Love that. Oh, so nice. <laughs> Take the tour to find out. Yes. <laughs> oh, yeah. Wow. Valentine's Day is it less than so a month pretty. away. It's like two weeks away, basically, if you think I about it. The wishing well. Yeah. Already. But then with the flowers, it just really, like, it looks so ugh, lush and pretty. And your favorite, your favorite spot in the park. <laughs> I feel like I'm enchanted and in snow all at once. <laughs> Make a wish. There's a lot of dollars in there. Whoa. Wow. 
Wow. I think we might have lunch covered. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Very cool. Okay, so now we're gonna head to Jolly Holiday and grab some snacks. Yes. Some hundreds Hun of themed snacks. Disney 100 snacks. <laughs> Fingers crossed they have everything still. <laughs> All right, made our way into Jolly Holiday and they had some cool like drinks that you can get. Um, this is a Mickey Mouse sipper, 32.49. A thermo tumbler for 13.49. And then this is my favorite, the stainless steel tumbler for 28.99. Here is a closer look at the stainless steel tumbler. It's Walt and Mickey at Disneyland with the carousel and it says Disney 100 on it. Very cool. Alright, we got a few treats here at Jolly Holiday. <laughs> Just a few. Well, this one's refreshment corner, but we'll yes. get there. So, starting with the special Disney 100 items, we got the lemon tea cake right here with the lemon curd, lemon zest glaze, and this is a fresh slice of lemon. So, we'll see if maybe that's inside. I don't know. Yeah, that's a pretty good portion, too. It looks really good. And then in the front here, we have the Platinum Trifle. It's sold at other locations, not just Jolly Holiday. Mm -hmm. I think it's at, you know, quite a handful of them. And so there's a chocolate cookie crumbles, cheesecake, cherry compote, chocolate cookie mousse, and creme fraiche chantilly with crunch pearls and a chocolate piece. Nice. Sounds so good. And then the back here is Mr. Banks from uh, Fair Hobbits. Yeah. Mr. Banks shirt by Tarte. Caramel and chocolate ganache in a sharp red tart, purple colored white chocolate mousse, sea salt, edible silver star, and silver crunch. Mm. And then over here at Refreshment Corner it's, is a Sprite. Yeah, it's sparkling grapes. Start with grape syrup and top with a candy strip. <laughs> nice. And then not uh, seasonal to the 100th, but, or it's still seasonal. It's seasonal, yeah. yeah. But not part of the 100th is a macaron with like chocolate and strawberry. Cho right? Yeah, it sounds delicious. Yeah. I love chocolate strawberry, so excited to try that. Mm -hmm. First, we are going to enjoy our Jolly Holiday combo, which is here all year yeah, round, well. but it's a cold day out, so it's going to taste amazing. I know that. And then my favorite chips in the park are here, so. House chips. Yeah, and then we got uh, to go <laughs> raspberry macaron. <laughs> All right, as you can see, we're a little, a little less than halfway through. Really tasty, I like this a lot. This tastes like grape, grapey Sprite. <laughs> yeah. That's how I'd describe it. <laughs> like grapes with a little, little kick of Sprite, a little, little lemon lime yeah. there. Sprite's like very like uh, bubbly. The grape kind of like milds it down a little bit. Um, but again, you just get like all grape flavor. And the it's colors really are cute. It's totally the colors of the celebration. So spot on. Yeah, Corny didn't have a little a little accident. Um, <laughs> It was, like me a, out. it was it was kind of sad actually. It was like a little high school like <laughs> like in a lunchroom. Yeah, high school lunchroom moment. Uh, there's like steps right here that lead from the freshman corner studio. Yeah. Up to the Jolly Holiday seating area. I said I'll get the drink. I'll get it. Don't worry. I'm like setting up the food, and all of a sudden I hear a, I, I hear something, and then everyone goes. <gasps> and I didn't really think anything of it, and I look up, and then Corny's like on the floor, but I don't see her on the floor. I just see her get up. I dropped the drink. She just she just appears, and then yeah, she she fell. I guess you misstepped and kind of. I just dropped the sprite completely. Customer was really nice and made a little magical moment and got us a new one. Yeah, she got the same flavor from me and everything. It was yeah. really sweet. So shout out to the customer who helped us out and um, I think your pride's a little, a little hurt. But you're actually like scraped up a little bit too. Yeah, yeah I you're, cut, I'm I looking at your, your finger right now, your finger sc scrapes. Um, but I'm glad you're okay. It's okay, thank yeah. you. <laughs> and so now we are gonna We're gonna enjoy shift these. gears. <laughs> <laughs> so now we are gonna shift gears to our wonderful dessert platter that we have spread, if you will. So many treats. So many. Uh, we destroyed the Jolly Holiday combo, ate all the chips. But yeah, so let's go ahead and start with the what is this? This is the, the trifle. The trifle. The platinum trifle. Let's go for it. I will let you start. So okay. hand me that and then just make sure you get just make sure you get all the layers. See, it's a little... Oh, it's actually chocolate on the back. It's not white chocolate. It's oh, yeah. Like milk chocolate. Nice, nice. I'll save that for later. <laughs> okay, I'm going to try and get all the way down. This reminds me of um, when Rachel took the trifle. The holiday trifle. Yeah, and there's like beef layers oh, in there. Oh, God. Oh, now I'm thinking of beef. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, this looks good. Mmm. This looks quite tasty. Mm. Oh, it's like, it looks like the gray stuff, actually. That they served at a village house. A lot of flavors going on. Mm. I got the tart cherry. It's like a cherry pie filling kind of. I got the creamy tangy cheesecake. And then like the great stuff. But, yeah, taste. and then there's like cookie crumbs on the bottom, right? Yeah. It's like a crushed up Oreo at the bottom. Wow. There's like smooth but crunchy cherries and crunchy cookies. Yeah, and the pearls on top are crunchy. It's really good. It's fun. Ooh, look at that. Look at that. I can see oh. all the flavors. The cookies are really hard to get at the bottom. Yeah. This is really good. This is a solid four and a half out of five. Ooh. This is really nice. Nice. 
I like it. You better pace yourself because we have a lot to try. <laughs> Up next is this lemon tea cake. Tea cake. It I want to say pound cake. It delicious. Yeah. It's been here before the hundredth, uh, like earlier this month. Save that again. Chocolate. <laughs> Let's go for it. It looks just like super, like fluffy and glazed. Yeah, that looks that looks pretty good. <laughs> Why did I quit you? Way more. Moss. I think there might be like curd inside of it. Let's see. I think so. There's some curd in the middle there. Yeah, that's not coming up in the camera, but I think I definitely see it. Oh yeah, yep, there, there it is. is. Yep. Mm. Nice. Now there's some people who do not like lemon as, like, as a dessert option, and that used to be me, but then my taste buds changed, and now I love like lemony desserts, sweets. It's super... This looks, this looks good. It's like light. Yes. It's kind of like old fashioned dessert. Kind of like a retro taste. It's really, really good. It just you can't go wrong. Mm -hmm. It's sweet, but like the tartness balances out the sweetness. I'll get this again for sure. I'm gonna say five out of five. Dang. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, I know people were raving about this. It's a nice size. Yeah. And then let's just jump straight into this last. If I have to. Option. Yeah, I know, right? So I'm really hard. twisting your arm here. I'm just gonna actually cut off this piece right here. Yeah. Go Look for at it. that. Oh wow. A little caramel layer. Looks good. Oh. <laughs> Can I see a little cross section? Oh yeah. Looks delicious. It's like homemade caramel in there too. Yeah. Ganache isn't too hard. Um, the frosting on top. It's your classic sugar. It's got a slight like, food coloring taste uh, in the frosting. But everything else, fantastic. Tart isn't too hard to chew through either. Mm -hmm. um, it's a four out of five. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. Mr. Banks. Mr. Banks. <laughs> I'm not sure why I say this, but Mr. Banks. Mr. Banks. Okay, Donnie has had a chance to try all three of the seasonal desserts. What I do agree you with you. First place is lemon. Second place, third place. Okay. But this not, is really good though. But there's no loser. Just there's, places. There's no loser. Yeah, everything yeah. is really good. I'm not like big on cherries. That's probably like my least favorite fruit actually in a dessert. Yeah, I would agree with that. And this has like whole cherries. I don't know, maybe like a size of a peanut M&M. Yeah. Uh, that's not terrible. That's not terrible, but I wish it didn't have I wish it maybe it was like a raspberry instead. But that's you know too what? close to the raspberry macaron. I know. Yeah. Or strawberry, but I feel like they maybe chose a cherry as like a retro thing. Like yeah. cherry jubilee, you know? Not me eating this with a knife. Oh my gosh. <laughs> So we weren't going to show this because it's not part of the hundredth. Still seasonal, as we mentioned before, um, but this is amazing. I give us a five out of five. Wow. I think it's better than the raspberry one. What? I said it. Really chocolate. Let me see inside there, though. Mm -hmm. Is there like strawberry jam? Mm -hmm. And we love the Disney macarons. Like we've had the hot chocolate yeah. one before. We had the oh, like a little jelly patty in there. Yeah. That looks awesome. I am this dying to try this. Fantastic. Reminds me of like, did we get a hot cocoa one? We did, Festival of the Holidays. Reminds me of that, and then you add strawberry to it. Ooh. And we love chocolate strawberry. Good combo. Yum. Five out of five, must try. Goodness. Come try it, folks. Mm -hmm. So we stopped into Disney Showcase to show off some of the 100th anniversary merchandise. It's basically a 100th anniversary store. Yeah, so. that's cool. I like uh, the big Donald and Daisy back there. It's really fun. It's like Disney Store back in the day. The band just did another number in front of the <laughs> train station. Uh, but here we are. We pointed this out earlier. It was in the Hayden's window that he did. It's actually a phone holder now. I'm seeing that better. Oh, yeah. Didn't catch that I either. love this. The mm -hmm. notepad. And there's actually Mickey's hidden in there. Oh, yeah, very nice. A little notepad. <laughs> Cute. $30. Nice. I actually really enjoy this t-shirt. And it has the uh, Disney 100 tag on it. It's I think very, it's so timeless. I just something, something about black and white. I think that's why we like Dalmatians so much. Yeah. It's very classic, very timeless, like we just mentioned. A magnifying glass. <laughs> if you want to be Inspector Mickey. Can put your eye through it. <laughs> That's the thumbnail right there. <laughs> <laughs> That's kind of cool for like an office or a desk. Yeah, exactly. This, uh, it's a memo board. Lights up, oh. like cartoonist desk. This Animator is pretty cool, stick. actually. You want to hold this for me? Yeah. This hat has all the um, different lands. lands. So Tomorrowland. Yeah. This is when the TV you, show. Yeah, yeah, exactly. The TV show. Frontierland. Yay. 
Fantasyland, Walt Disney, Land, Fantasyland, very cool. Adventureland, Adventure Land. Land. all around the world. $30. <laughs> and then here is another jacket right here. Really, really nice. It's well made. Yeah, it's pretty, has some heft to it. Will definitely keep you warm. Here's another spirit jersey. It says Mickey Mouse's sound cartoons. Very cool. Again, black and white. Got a big, nice Mickey right here. No price tag ever put on these. Tim Tracker first pointed it out so they can like <laughs> change the price. Yeah, that's funny. Here is a hat. This is Walt Disney Studios for thirty dollars. Orange motif going on here. Mm -hmm. The ears we showed earlier, thirty-four ninety-nine. This is really cool. Like the original Walt Disney cartoonist little picture mm -hmm. in the old Hyperion. Very cool. Twenty dollars. We've seen these. We haven't pointed them out yet. These bookends right here that are Mickey's shoes. They're kind of are uh, so awesome. Golden bronze. Yeah. Here is a beret that Courtney spotted. Really cute. But that's the top of it. And the back has Mickey's signature. It looks like the Mickey gears. Yeah. Just thirty dollars. And it's mostly wool. So that's a good deal. I kinda yeah. want this guy. I've seen I think I saw at least one guest wearing that earlier today. Oh man. <laughs> <laughs> uh, these shorts are really cool down here again. The orange writing that says Walt Disney Studios. And it has the matching top to go with it. <laughs> I period have me all right. Looks like a candle, but it's not. What is this? Oh, maybe not. Oh, I think it's a voto. You can like put the candle inside oh, okay, of it. Yeah, that yep. makes sense. Whoa, and the that's the, wall, the tower, right? At the Walt yeah. Disney Studios. We've seen that. Obviously, not that exact <laughs> model of it. I'm sure they've, they've redone Here it. Here it is. It's uh, quite heavy. I thought you were going to try to full on lift no, it. It's not metal. It's like a plastic or a vinyl, but mm. like it's heavy. For $99.99. <laughs> All right, I wanted to point out some more merchandise. This is the same shirt we saw earlier, but in youth size. Um, they have this really cool picture frame with like Mickey Mouse on top. As part of uh, as part of the 100th, here is a really awesome sweater with like a little front pocket. You don't see that too. Very classic. Too much anymore. Well, the ones he made us laugh. I don't know why. Just <laughs> yeah. This looks a little in the orange. So and bright. then this like yellow tag that says this will catch fire like no, it says that your garment should be snug on your child yeah or uh, if not like it'll be yeah fire. exactly it'll be yeah it'll be more like it's a, a heartwarming warning for those with young <laughs> too children. long didn't read uh it will catch fire it's, it's really pillow. massive pillow. it is vegan leather pleather mm, nice i love that fifty dollars that's not bad this shirt is just calling my name but a lot of the normal like range of sizes, so you mm -hmm. only have like really small and really large yeah. in the stores right and now. And then make sure you obviously do not pay attention to this like little tag right here because this says 1X and this is actually a 3X. So make sure you're getting the right size. And then this shirt as well, part of the 100th, Walt Disney's Disneyland. Really classic look. And then this is also, same thing, another very classic t-shirt. It's got Tinkerbell. Yay, it says Disneyland. Some dog oh. accessories. Dog spirit jersey. We love putting our dog. <laughs> she's in one right now. At our house. She is. Cause she's cold. It looks great. Getting in. Classic. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is nice. Yeah, a long sleeve. One hundred years of wonder. Yeah. Everyone gets so excited for the socks. Oh, it feels like ASMR in my hand. <laughs> Whoa, it feels crazy. Um, Disneyland and then the Starbucks yeah, icon, fifty dollars. Oh my gosh. I can't describe how it feels in my hands. It feels like. Electric. Oh wow. <laughs> yeah. What's this? We've got oh, my cool guy Mickey with all of his perk goat accessories. He's ready for the day. I thought that's what he was officially called was cool guy Mickey. Cool guy Mickey but, but you're you're calling him that. Okay. And then oh, just some, fun, some plushes chrome and Mickey and yeah. Minnie. Kind of fun. And Pluto down there. Yeah. Thirty dollars. Cool. Little picture oh, frame, four by six. I love the pillow. I love that opening. Yeah. You always see that. That's really classy. Mm -hmm. Had to point this out. This shirt is absolutely awesome. It's very lightweight. Part of the, very lightweight for the summer, which is good for me because I get warm really easily. Yeah. It is sixty dollars. This is three X. That's pretty big. Um, but it has like different like tickets, right? I don't even know what this is. It's like a different memorabilia. Like a, maps yeah. Here's the here's the ticket book. Yeah. But this is like yeah, like you said, maps. This is a picture of Frontierland. The outside. Book. Yeah, it just it goes the well. The parking pass opening day. Mm -hmm. It's really nice. Yeah. And this is six dollars. Yeah. And, and this they is have funny a children's one. Yeah, so cute, be matching. <laughs> and they all kind of differ, you know, like a Dooney and Burke. 
yeah, the way the fabric exactly. is cut. Just look well, at the pocket here. This is yep. That's yeah, cool. Look at this kid's one official right here. Official roadmap to design. That's awesome. Yeah. On this shirt over here too. It is amazing. They actually really stepped up their game, is what I would say. Actually, um, but this is like that classic, like Mickey cartoon. Sixty bucks. Chippendale. This is like Sunday cartoon vibes right here, or Saturday, Saturday cartoon vibes. And then I love this sweater as well. And this Minnie Mouse sweater too. Like this is a cardigan. Hint, hint. Hint, hint, yeah, hint, hint, hint. It's very soft in yeah. person too. <laughs> Very nice. And then they also have like the same color purple in the backpack. I have a bucket hat. There's a lot going on here. All right, everyone. Well, that is it for this video inside Disneyland for the 100th celebration. Yeah, we love checking out the decorations, the characters' new costumes. There was so much good merch. Yeah. And the treats, definitely recommend them. Really mm -hmm. good. Yeah, uh, we will definitely be here soon because we want to check out the nighttime spectaculars, World of Color, and then Wondrous Journeys, the, the fireworks. fireworks show. They have heard wonderful things. Mm -hmm. So we will be back soon to come check those out. And then maybe we'll be more successful trying to <laughs> get the reservations for uh, Team Town. Yeah. yeah, so fingers crossed. But so far, I mean, I really love the 100. It's yeah. been a great celebration and classy, as you said. Classy and elegant. I'm sure they're going to release more and more merchandise as mm -hmm. it continues. So yeah. we'll be looking forward to that. Yeah, so thanks so much for watching this video, and we will be sure to catch you in the next one. We'll see, see you real soon. soon.